Hey guys, uh, my name is Kate. I did my bachelor's in physiology with my major in neuroscience. And currently I'm studying my master's pharmaceutical biotechnology. So actually my thesis was on the topic of depression and uh, possible genetic approach to the treatment of this condition. So I consider myself uh, competent enough because I have a diploma uh, on specifically that topic in order to be speaking about it. And uh, this video I'd like to dedicate to uh, depression because um, currently I've been healing and uh, I think we get to share like, like this positive energy and uh, positive vibes. So I like to start that like the majority of people like in my country and a lot of like uh, my friends do not like really take into consideration this kind of disease. It's just a sadness condition or something like that, uh, something casual and normal. But in fact, <laughs> the Western world has been dedicated kind of. <laughs> millions of publications in articles like Nature, Science, uh, Cell to so this condition it is a psychotic condition it is real, alright? so if you are experiencing like two weeks or more kinda sadness, kinda loss of appetite or you eat a lot, much more than usually you have problems with your circadian rhythms like you can not sleep well or you oversleep by, by that I mean like probably 11 hours or so or you like go to bed you waste two three hours just to fall asleep and like then you sleep for 13 hours straight so that is not normal well also one of the symptoms is that you cannot enjoy your normal basic hobbies that you used to and like you don't want actually to hang out with anyone or it's kind of limited so much so that is not actually what you really would like to do like deep down you'd like to hang out probably but you're like don't have this courage or you like really want to go but then like in this final moment you just say god i'm not gonna do it i really don't want to. so like you change these concepts within your mind and you probably like to be social but it's like so energy consuming it's so fucking hard and finally yeah you're tired most of the time you can't like go to study or work or do essential things that you are supposed to do that previously been doing pretty well and without so huge contribute energetic contribution from your side probably you have like this routine in the morning it's more or less satisfactory and then like one little thing happens basically it could be a phone call with your mom or like some kind of message or literally like one super small thing that can fucking change your mood it's like going down drastically you're being depressed you're being anxious you're being down like you're being uh, really um, sometimes paranoid or probably you have this panic or anxiety attack just out of the blue like, like usually it wouldn't change anything to you you just like probably put your boundaries and ignore it but in this kind of case you're taking it everything like personally so deeply and you kind of sleep just to the hole of your heart and uh, stay there so be true to yourself you can accept it like i mean seriously i fucking understand you there are 
tons of people out there who are experiencing this condition. It is absolutely real. It is treatable. It's possible to stop this. It's just like you gotta be seriously working and you're gonna feel this like self-development and this self-work. It's almost like exercising your muscles because you actually feel how hard it gets to go kind of next level of your self-development. Thank you very much for your attention. We will definitely continue this discussion. And I will see you soon. Bye!